Welcome back everyone. This is chapter 8. Here we are going to learn about how to configure the interface using NMCLI. This is command line utility. Before we have learned about TUI, now we are going to learn about CLI. So make our work very easier and to understand the NMCLI, we are going to install one of the package bash hyphen completion. So let me search for the package and I will show you how to install it search bash this will give us two package which will be bash and bash hyphen completion in this we are going to install the bash hyphen completion once I install this package I want to log out from this session and re log into the server to activate this little small tiny tool this tool this bash completion command will make a command complete whenever we are using tab key in most of the distribution this one is available all the distribution this this one is this package is available already i have here installed so i am going to log out and re-log in the server uh, what the use of this uh, this uh, bash completion is just i want to type the command nmcli and i if i press tab tab the it will show the options available option so we don't want to remember by heart for uh, all the commands and options which is related to NMCLI. So what uh, this is I am going to install. Uh, and one more thing, if you have choose your type of installation with minimal installation, this require want to be installed. If not, it's not required. Now we are going to issue the command NMCLI. See, I have pressed tab key so we are getting the options available command uh, options for the nmcli command nmcli device show or connection show if i am typing nmcli and my option is connection or device then again i if i am pressing the tab key i will get the arguments uh, sorry options what are the available options so I will let me type nmcli see device and next to device connect like this one by one I can use the tab to see what are the available options it's very easier to learn the nmcli if we have the bash completion package installed so let me list all the interfaces we have four interfaces ENP 0s 10 3 8 and 9 a 3 and 8 I am uh, currently our server is using and the 9 and 10 I have created for demonstration purpose so we are going to work with the 9 and 10 interface okay let us start to learn the NMCLI commands and with option I am going to add a new connection so for that I am using the command nmcli connection add then I want to give the connection name the connection name is geek1 and the type was ethernet my connection type was ethernet and if name that is interface name enp0s9 so it was successfully created the connection geek1 with uld b4f6 e 382 something successfully created so this is the command which we have used to create a connection name so we have successfully created the connection now let us try to bring up the connection our interface using the connection name let me bring up the interface using nmcla connection of geek1 so this command will bring up our interface successfully using the connection name connection successfully activated you can see that connection was activated using the connection name nmcli then if you want to list all the connections available connections we can use the command nmcli connection show the show command will show all the available interfaces if I want to use I want to see the a specific interface I can mention the interface 
a device name or a interface name example uh, nmcli connection show the ENP0S9 this will show very detailed information so let me pipe put the pipe and more because the detailed information will be very long the this one will provide a detailed information very very long information about the interface so only the show command will show all the print all the available interfaces but if we are going to look into the more information we want to specify the interface name to print the IP addresses we can use the command IP space A or IP address ADD or or in back in rel 6 we used to come uh, use the command to print the IPs IF config instead we can use here IP space A or IP ADD or something so it will print the IP uh, for every interfaces now NMCLI let me disconnect the device NMCLI device disconnect this is connect, we can't able to disconnect to see connection name disconnect ENP0S9 uh, device ENP0S9 successfully disconnected and let me try to add a new connection NMCLI connection at connection name geek Two, let it be two. Before before we have added any uh, uh, connection name, it is the we have not specified that what kind of IP, the static IP or DSCP. So this connection, I'm going to create with the static static IP. If we are not providing the static IP information while we are creating a connection, it will be the IP will be assigned from the DSCP. So this one is uh, I want to assign the IP with static one so I am going to create now with a static IP and I am CLI connection add connection name geek2 type ethernet and interface name ENP0S10 and the IP address 4 version IPv4 version IP4 10.0.2.17 the subnet mask 255.255.255.0 or 24 and the gateway also I want to mention with the IPv4 version gateway so gw4 10.0.2.2 and presenter the connection was geek2 was successfully added so this address i want to men, uh, add my uh, dns address so i am going to uh, add it and i'm the connection mod that means i am modifying my geek2 connection name and plus IPv4 I am adding the information so plus IPv4.dns and the DNS address so like this we can add the DNS information and let me bring up the interface NMCLI connection up ENP0S10 it was connect, uh, connection was successfully up so uh, NMCLI connection up geek1 the connection successfully activated fine on the geek 2 the connection successfully activated every connection are success the geek 1 was assigned the IP is assigned from DACP and the geek 2 was assigned the IP was assigned static which I have entered the information IP information to bring down any one of the interface we can use the command NMCLA connection down and the connection name here NMCLA connection down geek1 and geek2 so the interface was down and to assign the host name it is very important just to print the host name information we can use the command host name CTL host name control to set a host name host name CTL set hyphen host name and the name of the host name let me give server.geekvideos.com uh, and let me change back the name to the regular one uh, to print the name host name ctl or host name server.geekvideos.com so let me change back the name to my original model which I am 
original one which I am using for the demonstration. Hostname CTL, set hostname server.testenvironment.com. This will set the hostname, and to print the hostname, we can use the command hostname or hostname CTL. So, there are many available options are available. Uh, many many options or arguments we can use in the enum cli for knowing that we can issue the command man5 number 5 enum hyphen settings so once we going through the man page of uh, enum cli settings we can get plenty of there are a lot of lot of information we can use the ca path ca certificate information client certificate like this uh, we can use a lot of information lot of lot of options and arguments with the nmcli command to configure any interfaces so it's a very huge man page once we go through all the man pages uh, it will be very uh, if we go through all the man uh, go through this full man page we will come to know what are the available options are here and it's very easier one for using the nmcli we can use the command man nmcli uh, once we go through the nmcli uh, man page we will get the all the available uh, options and arguments what are the how to use the arguments and the options it's very good to read the uh, man pages so we can see uh, what are the options we have seen is little bit three or four commands but uh, there are plenty plenty of uh, hundreds of commands we can uh, use uh, not commands options and configuring method by reading the manner man page of nmcli it's very good to read the man page and understand it it will be it will help in many case but for examination prepare uh just we want to know about how to create a connection name and how to assign a ip how to assign a subnet mask how to assign the dns and gateway and how to bring up the interface and down the interface so to print the ips this is very easier one here before we use if config now we are using ip space a or ip addr like that we can use very short so let me see in another tutorial soon Please subscribe and keep on practicing the NMCLI command to get from you. Thank you, thank you for watching.